What's up everybody, my name is Spencer and this is American Electrician. On today's video, we're gonna be doing a short unboxing video. I just ordered some new stuff from Amazon, so we're gonna take a look at it. We're gonna do my first impressions and just a little bit of a review. Obviously, haven't used the tools yet, so a, an actual full review will be coming later on. If you're new to the channel, welcome. On American Electrician, we do electrical how-tos as well as gear reviews, uh, like such as hand tools, power tools, and gear storage. So if that's something you guys are interested in, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. But for now, let's get started. All right, so first things first, before we get to the actual box, I did order a couple other things with this order and they did not come in super early. So I opened them because I am impatient. These are the two sets of screwdrivers that I ordered and opened earlier this week. The one on my left here is a five piece insulated set from Weha uh, with two Phillips and three flat uh, going from a 6.5, which is this right here, which I believe is their quarter inch all the way down to whatever this is. It looks like a, just a 3.0. Um, so little itty bitty screwdriver here, but it's uh, pretty comfortable. I do like the feel of these handles quite a bit. So I haven't got to use them yet. I was kind of waiting to do this video, but these are my first uh, solo Weha screwdrivers other than my little ones. So I like the colors a lot too. It feels good in your hand and it comes in this little package that's going to get thrown in the garbage like most packaging does. Uh, and then the other set of screwdrivers that I have here are these Philo insulated drivers. Now both of these sets were about $20. Uh, so as you can see, you get a lot more bang for your buck with the Weha. But I do have to say that these Philo drivers look awesome. Uh, they, they really feel good in your hand and I like how there's a little bit of curvature to it unlike these Weha's, but these Weha's are very comfortable as well. So, uh, and this comes with one Phillips and two flat. And as you can see, these are obviously the same screwdrivers that, uh, that Philo is rebranded for Fluke. So all their insulated screwdrivers are this exact model here with the number two Phillips, 5.5 uh, mil slotted. And then I believe this is a three or a 3.5. It's actually a four. I was wrong. So um, this is the two sets of screwdrivers that I opened before. So now that these are done, we can get these out of the way. Now, this is a huge case. This is much, much bigger than I thought it was going to be. Honestly, I went through a lot of different sets from Knipex before finally settling on this set here. I just, it really felt like the most bang for your buck. Um, and honestly, it was just kind of, kind of a spur of the moment thing, but I ended up getting it and I really have been waiting to check this thing out. So let's give it a look. If I can ever figure out how to open this thing. So these little grooves here slide out and everything's all over the place. But look at that beautiful mess right there. These are also my first Whittle screwdrivers. Our However you say it, honestly, I'm not sure. Um, but there's like a set of, I believe five in here and of the insulated screwdrivers. And I do like, I like the feel of these. Um, I'll have to test them out in the field to see what they are like. But obviously I love Knibex pliers. And so for me, this was just like a really good set to get. So I do like these, these feel really nice in your hand. They're a little bit, like a triangular shape. Um, it's like with one side here, a side underneath, and then over here, uh, it kinda, kinda feels nice. 
and I, I can't wait to see how these fit into screws. Now for the pliers, we'll get all these wrappings off real quick. All right, so this is the set of five pliers that you get with this, with the 10 inch diagonal cutters that are uh, with the straight jaw, not with the angled. Um, obviously they come out of the box very, very loose, which is fantastic. And I'm sure they have the same cutting as the other, uh, any of the other Knipex diagonal cutters. Uh, so these will be great to use. Uh, got the nine and a half inch lineman's, New England lineman's pliers. These things are monsters. I love these handles quite a bit. Um, all the other features, got a fish tape puller and your conduit reamer on the inside. So these feel great. Now, I don't actually have a pair of these yet. Uh, so I've been kind of wanting to try these out. These are like five inch shears, I believe. And these are a little bit stiff as most of these, this type of jointed pliers are at first, but they definitely loosen up fairly quickly. Uh, we'll get some WD-40 on them in no time they'll be ready to go, but I do like these handles and I cannot wait to see how these cut. These are the eight inch uh, needle, needle nose pliers from Knipex. I actually have a pair of these and I love them. I use them all the time for all kinds of stuff. And then these are the 10 inch Cobras, uh, I'm sorry, the 10 inch alligator pliers, which are not the push button, but actually the slip joint, um, which I prefer the slip button or the button, but honestly, I don't ever need these to be insulated anyway. It'll just be nice to have. These handles are super comfortable. And these are super, super comfortable. So, and then last but not least, I actually did just pick up a Tubbo Towels uh, heavy duty cleaning wipes dispenser thing. Um, I just have used these on a job the other day and it took a lot of the grease and grime off my tools. And so I was pretty excited. So I went and ordered a bundle of them and we're gonna see how I like them. Uh, hopefully they work just as well as they did the other days. That wraps up our tool haul today. So if you guys are looking for any of these, I'm gonna leave a link in the description. Uh, obviously I haven't done a review on them except for the Knipex pliers. I know those are great, um, but if you guys are looking for any of these, I'll leave a link in the descriptions. Like if this video helped you at all, but thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys on the next one.